hello viewers uh, today I'm going to show you how to create uh, mean to copy bootable uh, bootable uh, software from u any USB uh, if you want to convert uh, any bootable let's say window or any program bootable program into from any USB or any CD ROM, uh, you want to copy it and keep it for next use uh, for some time. So I'm going to show you that how to do it and safely. Uh, first of all, you have to check under this video. I'm going to put uh, the link where you can download this image burn uh, image burn. Uh, it is software we're going to use on this video to create that uh, uh, convert that uh, ISO file to copy it from the USB. After you install this uh, program, you have to download it and install it. Uh, double click and install it. If you know how, you don't know how to install it, you can uh, leave your comment below. I will give you send you a video link where you can. Uh, know how to install it so after installing it uh, the next you have to do is to install uh, to plug in your USB uh, USB on your computer just like this so this USB now is already plugged in so already is bootable it's already on bootable you see it's bootable USB drive you can see this logo is already bootable so it's window 10 is in here so I want to copy this window 10 and keep it on this folder a uh, local folder so I'm gonna check this window and copy it to this folder so that I can use it I can format this USB and use it for other things so now for the next use I can go straight here and bring it back here and it will be bootable. So let's start. So we're gonna take from here to here. Know that. So you open the image burner right here. Uh, you have to go straight here and uh, select uh, sorry you select where USB you want to copy open that is already in the list okay so it's already on the list as you can see so here already selected and uh, I want uh, the destination to be on the D so which is also already selected but I'm gonna show you one more time I want it to come to E look at disk okay I'm gonna open that and uh, I'm gonna I want it to save on this folder Windows 10 I'm gonna place this folder like I can say Windows 10 Windows 10 I so I say like that okay let me make it this way for easy understanding so this folder will be like this so I'm gonna I want it to save on this folder so after that you're gonna come to this advance you click advance you click uh, bootable disk then you have to check this box uh, make image uh, bootable so once you check that box you have to choose the you have to go and choose the uh, ETF S boot that you can get right inside the USB once you click let me go back you have to open the USB you have to open the boot then you have to choose this file here right here open it 
so on this uh, developer ID you have to put in this uh, Microsoft uh, Corporation that is the developer of this boot uh, ID is there so on this uh, sectors to load so you have to put uh, this number just put eight in there so here right here you have to I want it to extract to disk disk E so we are done with that so I'm gonna click now to build okay so right here he said uh, confirm the volume level and the stuff uh, so after that uh, that one uh, you have to you will have this uh, small pop-up here after you confirm the default uh, UDF you have this pop-up here so that you have to click OK so once click OK the process started so now this will be copied to to this uh, folder where I located uh, where I, I indicated for you to copy so right now the process is on see it takes uh, some minutes uh, it's not uh, a difficult tax uh, I think uh, the file there is almost <coughs> the file is um, is about uh, three three point something gigabyte so it's take a little bit a uh, while also you can uh, check on other videos on how to create a bootable USB file I mean uh, ISO file in order to use it for uh, maybe formatting your computer or changing windows or some other things maybe you purchase some game programs and it came it comes on uh, ISO file or bootable you can easily put it on on your flash drive and uh, install it also note before you can uh, install any uh, ISO file on any flash drive uh, you must remove anything inside it let's say any music or any file additional on it because once you run any program first of all that program will format your uh, USB uh, USB before installing any bootable though you will receive a dialog which you will request uh, for you to allowed for formatting or something like that so, so in case uh, some people might uh, have uh, quick uh, clicking and uh, they will not uh, check on that unfortunately you will have uh, your files formatted then afterwards you'll be surprised so you have to make sure that uh, all those protocols observed you copy out whatever is in the file take it out separately then afterwards that you can start to uh, install or to uh, to copy bootable file into your USB so now we already here 99% uh, so we are done uh, operation successfully completed so 
they come back to edit to you that you are done with your file copying so i will say okay that is it and uh, so uh let's check uh, if all the file copied was there where we want it to be uh, i wanted this file to be on this for on this uh, disk so i'm gonna open this disk so you can see this is the iso file so it's uh, 3.15 gb so today created modified today so you can see right here i can use it for next time to install windows again so i think i hope this helps you and uh, i think uh this video might help you for your installations and uh, from uh, to copy files from USB or uh, uh, DVD. So, if this helps you, please kindly hit the like button and uh, don't forget to subscribe to this channel for next tutorial. Thank you for watching and also check below this video for the link we have to download this uh, image burner and also uh, in case uh, the video was not clear uh, also that link shows uh, some setup step by step on how to do this process you can cut you can uh, see the more information right there Thank you and uh, have a nice day.